Hi! This is a really short video because I feel like I'm going to start uploading videos that aren't as well planned and thought out mainly because I am not really good at planning things out. It's a lot of centralised energy and thought power into one thing and better at other things so yeah so that's what I'm going to start to do today I'm going to get ready go and hand my contract in because I'm starting a new job on Monday I've had a week off and I'm halfway through the week and I was supposed to have plans today and this morning I woke up and they were cancelled so that completely threw me through a loop it was nice because I got to stay in bed until 10 a.m but then because I know myself very well if I have a whole day and it's not planned out and I have no obligations I won't really get much done so I got up had breakfast three slices of pizza made an Instagram account for ADHD I felt bad that I don't really want to share anything on my personal one because I haven't really told a lot of people unless they're really close to me I'm quite a private person I really don't like sharing anything about myself to people that know me so on the internet it's fine it's, it, in terms of YouTube I feel comfortable partly because I'm just speaking to a camera at the end of the day there's nobody actually in front of me and I know it's similar with Instagram, but I do not feel comfortable showing who I am today to people that knew me 10 years ago. It makes me feel really uncomfortable, so I don't share anything on my personal one anyway. So in order for me to have that way of expressing myself, I've started a new Instagram channel, um, so I'll put that down below i don't know how it will go i might completely shut it down in a week after freaking out about cyber security or something so <laughs> we'll see anyway i have taken one 18 milligram tablet today because of my weight loss i went to the doctors about two weeks ago and they referred me to a dietitian so I'm going to have that appointment in two weeks time. I also volunteered for a blood test which I didn't enjoy but it was over very quickly and the bright side is that all of my bloods are better than fine so I am vegan and I have been for the past five years and then before that I was vegetarian since 18 and I was kind of raised only to eat white meat so I've never eaten red meat anyway and people are always skeptical that I'd be healthy I've never had a blood test to check my like b12 or calcium or the other blood stuff so I didn't really know but I just would always say well I've never had any problems so I think I'm fine but I had the blood test and everything is great. If anything, they give you little measuring things of like if you're in between these, your your optimum, your average. If anything, I was lower or higher than average. So for cholesterol, for example, obviously cholesterol is things that causes heart attacks because it clogs up your uh, arteries. arteries and mine is below the average which is great because it means that there's no crap on my organs which makes sense anyway because I really just you know have never or it's been a long time since I've eaten animal products that could add stuff onto my arteries so that's good anyway back to today starting a new job on Monday so I'm going to go and take my contract in today. It's already like 1pm um, and I'm not fully dressed. So I'm going to have to rush, get dressed. And oh, that's where I was going. Yeah, so because I'm starting the new job and then because of the weight loss, I stopped taking the medication, but I've started taking it again now. And so I have took one eighteen milligram today just to ease me back into it. I had pizza for breakfast. That's where I was going because... I fancied it <laughs> and I also knew if I took a tablet I probably won't have 
lunch as such yeah and then i've started the instagram so that is pretty much most of the updates i have some new loop ear plugs as well to try out so i might wear those today try those on i'm gonna go finish getting ready and then we can head out i'm not driving don't arrest me i managed to get out the house in five minutes which is really impressive for me so first of all well done me that's the first pat on the back for me today so i was able to do that before i started driving because i had a few things that i wanted to say i wanted to talk about them before i completely forgot yeah so at least i'm in the car all i have to do now is drive there which is fine it's quite cold today and i didn't bring a coat because I don't like, I don't know about you, but I don't like the feeling of things around my neck and face or arms. If I feel like it's touching my whole body and holding it in a place where it doesn't want to naturally fall, it makes me very uncomfortable. I could not put a coat on, so fortunately I've got the heat in on and heated seats which is good i'm gonna pop these experience pro loop earplugs in they arrived a few days ago and i've not tried them in yet i do have the loop experience i have the gold ones but these are the pro so these come with little inserts that you can put inside of the tunnel to block out even more noise they've changed the packaging as well since i first ordered it means less waste i guess too the only thing is all of the inserts are sitting in this little bundle the actual loop holder can only hold the earplugs so you can't really carry those around not that you'd want to change the size of the bud but the inserts i guess you just have to keep them in and then keep them in the case and if you didn't want to wear them excuse my nails by the way they are pretty ratchet at the moment so that's what they look like before i start driving one of the things that I wanted to mention is that since having a break from Zagtin and then starting it again, I've noticed that a lot of the side effects have come back. So when I first started taking it, I had really bad dry mouth all day and that has just come back straight away. So need to make sure that I'm drinking a lot of water. The other thing I wanted to mention is... I've obviously got a week off from work at the moment and oh my god, I looked in the mirror this morning, went to bed at like after 2am, all week I've been going to bed 1, 2, I think 3am the previous night which isn't good and I don't want to be in that habit but I really come alive at night time, I am trying to push myself to get into bed at 2 a.m and my mind is just giving me like brainwave after brainwave it's like do this do this do this and they're great ideas and i'm like where are you with this kind of inspiration and motivation at 6 p.m 7 p.m 8 p.m 9 p.m you're in work and you feel like right this evening i'm gonna do this 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 i come home fall on the sofa and will not move until like 11 i just cannot move i am it's like temporary par temporary paralysis all i want to do is sit on the sofa and watch tv skip to like two hours later hit midnight and my brain turns on and so that's kind of why i don't like going to bed before that time because i feel like there is so much that i could potentially be doing or have access to that I miss out on if I go to sleep so it's really unfortunate and I guess one of the perks of being able to work from home or have a flexible work schedule is that you don't have to adhere to those strict rules I unfortunately don't and I think my new job will be pretty limited in terms of hours as well which is what it is <laughs> if they don't get the best of me in those hours then it's because of the hours they make me work you know what I mean the other thing is i i mean if if you're a guy this just won't resonate the same but i looked in the mirror today uh, i've got a few spots at the moment but i don't really like care about or notice those but i looked in the mirror this morning and i'm just 
glowing not in terms of the colour of my skin not in terms of the quality of my skin but there are no dark circles under my eyes and I just look so refreshed and I've only had three days off work so far three days where I've been in the house I've been with my animals I've been for walks I've potted around in the garden and done some planting watched things chilled out and just given myself a break and I feel like I look so much more lifeful youthful it's crazy so yeah if you get the opportunity say if you're gonna get a new job if you get the opportunity to have some time off in between i'd really really strongly recommend it because even a week it just makes the world of difference as much as i'm sad that i've not been able to see my friend today i've had a good relaxed morning eating pizza and watching youtube so I think that's pretty much it. This mark is really annoying on my wheel because I cleaned, well, me and my boyfriend cleaned my car the other day with Superguard. I don't know if you've ever heard of or used Superguard, but they're like premium products. Hmm. I have no idea what that is. Anywho, let's go and have an adventure.